Mic check, mic check. What's kicking, family? I'm glad you've clicked in so I can check in with you. This is Mr. Batch, dressed to the nines on a day like today. Today's Valentine's Day, and uh, this... Got to get dressed up for the occasion. I figured I'd throw on the tux. There's a lot going on later this evening. <laughs> but what I'd like to speak to you all about today is that I'm a fan of the Phoenix Suns, and Steve Kerr's got to go. First, Steve Kerr's got to go. Steve Kerr has got to go. The general manager of the Phoenix Suns. Yo, you just jacked up my team. Jacked them up, man. What are you, stupid? First of all, you argue with D'Antoni last year, talking about, oh, we got to get some defense. You know, we'll never win a championship. Okay, I can understand that mentality because you got them rings being a Chicago Bull. But you're out west. You don't slow the game down out west. You figure a way to be able to run up and down and have a big presence in the post to throw in and kick back out. Look at Tim Duncan. Yo, one of, hey, him and Shaq are are two of the best big men that I've seen since Lou Al's, I mean, Lou Al's, I'm going a little too far back, since Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Okay? Steve Kerr is messing the team up. He traded for Shaq, got rid of the Matrix. The Matrix just got traded from Miami. Think about it. The Matrix, Sean Marion's contract would have expired this year, and we would have had some salary cap moved to make some room. We would have had a team that was still in a good nucleus and felt good about themselves. All we needed was to add a big man who can get up and down the floor and run with us, and any time we needed to throw it in and, you know, do a re- regular setup thing, fine, we would have been able to do it. Tony, they're screaming on him because all it is is offense. Okay, all it is is offense, but you need some exact pieces now. Amari Stoudemire went off. He was doing his thing. All right, Shaq came in to trade. Now we've got Shaq's crazy, and how are we going to move Shaq? Now they want to move Amari Stoudemire. Oh, my goodness. And then... You're talking about you don't even want to trade with the Knicks. See, that's that. Yo, you're making stupid money. You're not doing what's best for the team. Being that you got a personal gripe with D'Antoni, you don't want to do a trade. Because if if the trade with Amari Stoudemire and New York, as I heard, you know, some of the trade stuff talking about, okay, if Amari Stoudemire was a trade, they would give up Chandler and Lee and go to Phoenix. Wow. That would be good for Phoenix. You know, that would be a nice plot. But being that Steve Kerr has got that little chip on his shoulder, I was going to say something else, but I'd like to keep it clean so I could keep a lot of people watching. Being that Steve Kerr got that chip on his shoulder, he doesn't want to deal with Antonio. Now we're going to look to get rid of Amari. He's blowing up the whole team. Blowing up the whole team. We are no longer in contention now. I don't even hear too much about Steve. I read about Steve. Steve Nash is not a happy camper. I'm glad when his contract will be up, he'll be able to go someplace else. And he'll be able to at least play a backup role because I think he'll be on the other side of 30. So at that point, uh, what will happen then is that, you know, his minutes will be cut down and he'll be able to give some veteran leadership to a team that's on the title run. And that's a guy I hope gets a ring. I hope he gets a ring. But right now, it's going to be the All-Star Weekend because it's also Valentine's Day. I'm dressed up like this for a special occasion. Oh, yes. It's Valentine's Day. It's also All-Star Weekend, and it's also the first race weekend for NASCAR, so it's a great weekend. So it'll be March Madness, and a whole lot of other stuff will be coming up. So, on that note, this is Mr. Batch, hating Steve Kerr and the Phoenix Suns for messing up my crew. And I'm out of here, and I'm going to beat him in the head with something soon. Peace. Break it down, break it down